You've set up your LinkedIn account, filled in descriptions for employment and educational history, optimized your headline, and create a summary bio that showcases your top skills. So now what? Start by making connections with people in your professional world. They could be classmates, faculty members, or people you've worked with at jobs and internships. Simply enter a name in the search bar at the top of your LinkedIn screen and you'll see a list of matches in the results. LinkedIn may also automatically suggest people that you may know. When you're searching for connections, you should be aware of your account's privacy settings. To check this, click on Me by your profile picture in the upper right and go to Settings and Privacy. Under Profile Viewing Options, you'll have the ability to choose how your information will appear to others when you view their profile. If you don't mind people knowing when you look at their profile, you can allow your full name and headline to be displayed. If you would rather browse profiles anonymously, you can select Private Mode. Another option allows them to see only your private profile characteristics which usually means your job title and the industry you work in. When you're making this decision, remember that there's a catch. If you browse in private mode, the people looking at your profile will also be anonymous, so you'll have far less information about who's searching for you. As a LinkedIn newcomer, you also want to avoid connecting with random people or people that you've never met. Keep your connections on LinkedIn professional. If you want to connect with someone you don't know yet, be sure to send a customized note along with the connection request. Let them know who you are and how you're familiar with their work. For example, you could say, Hello, Mr. Smith. I recently saw you speak at a conference in Columbia and really enjoyed hearing about your work in COBRA studies. I would love the opportunity to connect here on LinkedIn. Doesn't that sound better than a generic striker wants to add you to their network? Once you build up your professional network, you could start asking for recommendations. Just like in the real world, a recommendation on your LinkedIn profile can give you some extra credibility of a prospective employer. You can ask for recommendations from current or former coworkers and supervisors, colleagues from community service projects, or any other professional connections as long as they have first-hand experience with your work ethic and professional values. Simply scroll down to the recommendation section of your LinkedIn profile and click Ask for a Recommendation. Remember this kind of community support goes both ways. When someone asks you for a recommendation, you should write them one too if you can. You'll get out of the digital community what you put in, so be sure to check your timeline at least once a day like, comment, and share posts that resonate with you, write posts of your own, using appropriate hashtags to help increase your visibility, and never ask for a job in a LinkedIn post, comment, or message. That's like stopping someone in the street and asking them to hire you. Instead, you could search for jobs on the LinkedIn job board and apply to positions that interest you. Lastly, you should use LinkedIn as an opportunity to build your professional brand. LinkedIn is a uniquely professional social network, so the type of posts that you share should concentrate on your career and industry-related interest. Save the photos of your baby niece or videos of your cat for Instagram. And while you're busy posting, sharing, liking, and commenting, keep in mind that all of your activity is public. A simple like or comment is often viewed as an endorsement of the original post, so be careful where you click. Another way to build your brand is by writing articles on LinkedIn and posting them in a blog style format to your profile. This is a great way to share your perspective about topics in your field and demonstrate your expertise to future employers. You can also attach work samples to your listed work experience, making your LinkedIn profile into a portfolio that not only tells people why you would be a great fit for their organization, but shows them exactly what you have to offer. Follow these tips and you'll be a LinkedIn all-star in no time. Good luck.